Oxy what? Oxy, oxy something. Oxy toasted. What do you know about the neurobiology of motherhood? A woman's body undergoes quite a few changes during the transition to motherhood. Many of these changes are the result of changing hormone levels, and one of these hormones is oxytocin. So what is oxytocin? Oxytocin is a hormone that's made in the brain, but is used all throughout the body. We all make oxytocin but people differ in the amounts of oxytocin that they produce. Oxytocin has an important role in pregnancy and childbirth. It helps with contractions and labor, the delivery of a baby, and breastfeeding. In fact, as pregnancy progresses, a woman's body makes more of both the hormone and the receptor that catches oxytocin and tells the body what to do with it. We now know that oxytocin also has an effect on our relationships with other people, making us more trusting and generous, and better able to understand other people's feelings. Another important role for oxytocin is that it helps to reduce feelings of stress and anxiety. Some women feel anxious or depressed during pregnancy and after giving birth, and this can affect their relationship with their babies. Could oxytocin help explain mood during this time? Our research team wanted to know whether measuring oxytocin might help us understand a mother's mood and behavior in the transition to parenthood. Over 400 women agreed to help us find answers to our questions. That's pretty cool. So, here is an overview of the study. Participants were recruited when they were pregnant, and we revisited them several times during their pregnancy and just after birth. During each visit, they answered a lot of questionnaires about how they were feeling, and they gave us a small tube of blood to measure oxytocin with. They even let us look at their medical charts. At the last visit, we also filmed them playing with their two-month-old baby. So what did we find out? One! Oxytocin helps women understand facial expressions, like this one, and this one, and this one. In mothers with a difficult past, oxytocin helped protect against depression. Three. Oxytocin helped these moms with a difficult past be more responsive and warm towards their babies. So in the end, we learned more about how oxytocin helps prepare new moms for the transition to motherhood, especially those who have had a lot of stress in their lives. By brightening their mood, helping them pay attention to their baby's cues, and being warm and affectionate. Oxytocin is a valuable natural messenger that helps prepare new moms for their transition to motherhood. That's really cool. That's really cool, mommy. <laughs>